She's gonna kick like that when she goes. Say hi, Randy. Hi, Randy. <laughs> Guess what, guys? We're here at Mid Lake. We're getting ready to kick off the season. Uh, we're out in Randy's boat. We're gonna have a good time. Uh, we're gonna try and catch some fish. Focus is we're gonna find clean water. Um, I know where some is a little bit around the 30 to 38 mile marker, and that's where we're heading. We're gonna fish in that area. We'll try our luck and see what we can do. We're gonna get ourselves checked in and uh, wait for takeoff. And I'll see you guys at the first spot. That. This jerkbait's not gonna work. You know what that means? You transition to wiggle work. Something with a little bit of sound, a little bit of vibration. Something that they can hone in on. Question is, what color? You know, these crawdads aren't exactly bright, bright red yet. They're more like a natural color. So. Looks like one here needs new hooks. Let me put new hooks on that one. So we'll go with the natural curl. And uh, a little bit of orange in it, a little bit of red. It's not uh, too flashy. I think I just missed one. I got him. <laughs> you got it? Yeah. Fish? Yeah. Big? Nope. Yeah. Nope. On a wiggle. <laughs> Dang. Oh, on a crappie. On a crappie. No wonder he was so feisty at first. Buddy, this lure is the length of you. What are you doing, huh? <laughs> Whee! It says, take the hit, trade mine in. <gasps> You're not going to believe this. I got a good one. Oh, he's gone. I actually had a fish. That's nice. That's really nice. Let's look, look make at this. it look big. Woo! Make it real big. <laughs> That's all keeper right there. Nice one, Randy. Well, here we are, guys. We're uh, pulled out a little bit earlier. As you can see, we're having some motor issues, but we were able to get it on plane. It was a tough day. We had one good solid bite, and I lost it. Caught a crappie, and he caught a shad. So it wasn't exactly ideal conditions for fishing, and we figured we were ahead of the game. Might as well go pull the boat out while it's still running and we got it off the water. We're just gonna grab a bite to eat, take it easy, and uh, unfortunately it was just a tough day of fishing for us, so tomorrow hopefully Palmy treats me better. But nonetheless, we had fun. Fishing anytime, no matter what the weather's like, beats work. There you have it guys, that wraps up the Mid Lake Tournament. First one of the year, it was a brutal grind. Uh, it, it was just tough. I mean, the bite wasn't there, these fish are, I'm not going to say the fish are in a funk because the fish are doing what they want to do. It's me not being able to adapt or I don't even have the knowledge to know how to adapt to catch these cold weather fish. It's just something I've never had the knowledge to do or don't even have the experience because I fish this cold water very rarely. And so I struggled really bad. Randy and I could not get on a pattern whatsoever. One crappie, one shad hooked onto one good one but i was afraid to set the hook because i was thinking i think i was running eight or maybe ten pound test and if you watch some of my videos you know when i set the hook i usually leave my shoes and so to do a soft hook set that's really hard for me to do but but i try and um uh, but i don't feel bad because we pulled out of the water early just because we didn't want to break down in the middle of the you know cold day windy it's just Better to just get off the water early, but I found out later on that the bite was extremely tough because the Mid Lake Bass Club is a really good bass club filled with a lot of really good anglers, and it took ten and a half pounds to win that tournament. That's it, ten and a half pounds, and not one single limit was weighed in out of thirty plus boats. 
that tells you how tough it was up there in the mid lake area so i don't feel so bad it was a grind some tournaments are just like that some days you just don't get on them and that's all there is to it and then other days you do catch them sorry about that i had a phone call but needless to say it was fun getting on the water with randy it was an experience getting his boat out on plane it just for some reason was bogging down really bad but nonetheless we made the most of it we got off the water went and had an awesome lunch and uh yeah nonetheless i don't feel bad if i didn't catch any fish when the rest of the field struggled that much too so anyways tight lines to you guys you have an awesome day and i'll see you next time on the water Thank <laughs> you.